Hey guys, Minecraft stuff here. Today I'm doing the top 10 um, vault weapons because my top 10 ways to kill a creeper video was very popular. So I decided to make this. It probably will qu lag quite a lot because it uses quite a lot of explosives. So uh, hopefully it won't lag too much. And yeah, I'm going to get straight on with the video. So I hope you enjoy. So guys, at number 10 is spikes, which are these, so they look quite cool. Uh, let me just turn on the uh, volume quickly, so you might... Oh, damn. One sec. Right. So, spikes are quite cool. So, you probably can already guess what they do, so... It just hurts entities, so it's quite slow, but yeah, that's all it really does, so I'll get on to number nine. So guys, at number nine is the mine, that rhymed, so basically, if you get loads of zombies, they're quite noisy, put down a mine, this can lag a bit. Should. Yeah, there. So, they make small explosions. They're not very powerful, but... Oh. There. There, they lag a bit, but... That's all on mine, so... As you can hear, they're very noisy, so... So... They do... Well, they're bigger than I thought they were. They make about the same size as TNT. They can lag quite a bit, but... So, I'll go on to number 8. So guys, at number 8, it's a grenade. It doesn't really do that much damage, but I'll show you anyway. It's only at number 8, so... She spawn loads of zombies, chuck it. Just does a little explosion. Doesn't really do that much damage, which is only what's at number eight, but so I'll get on to number seven. So guys, at number seven it's the shrapnel grenade. I haven't really tested this one that much because it crashed. But here goes. Oh. Just shoots fire arrows everywhere, really. It can lag quite badly. But. Doesn't really do that much, but it's pretty cool. Watching fire arrows explode everywhere. This might lag. So, it's quite cool. So I'll move on to number six. So guys, next up I've got the rejuvenation missile. As you see, I've made a hole here with the grenades. This is a rocket launcher, which I'll show you later on, which is used for firing rockets. But I'm gonna. This is the rejuvenation missile. So if you fire it, as you see, there's a hole. It repairs it. So there. It resets what happened to the seed. So when it started, it does it replaces all the damage. So yeah, I'll move on to the next one. So guys, at number five, I've got the rocket launcher. So I just showed you it with a rejuvenation missile. There are quite a lot of missiles like this. This is just a normal basic missile. It can fire quite a lot. If I show you, uh, where's the search bar gone? Uh, if I quickly show you all the missiles there are, there's all of these are missiles. So there's quite a lot, and it can fire. I think all all of them. So this is just the basic missile. I'm gonna show. Oh, what's that? Anyway, this is a basic missile. So 
I just fire it. Should shoot. There. That's just a normal missile. I can blow this up. I don't know what it is, but. So. Just. That's quite a lot of damage. You can use a lot big, um, more devastating missiles, but this is a little one. Just because I didn't want it to lag. So. I move on to number four. So guys, at number four, I've got a missile launcher. I'm not going to go into how you really build this. You put the screen thing, then the launcher support, which is how accurate it is, and then the main bit. And I'm getting power from these, so better let them warm up. Put coal in, and then this pipe powers this. So if you right click on it, put the, mi the missile in, and there, it's pretty awesome. I don't know if it's powered up yet. Uh, it's warming up, so when that gets to 400, it'll be ready. So, whilst I'm waiting for it to warm up, this, you right and click where you want it to lock onto. And then, so if I want it there, it's now locked on there. If I come back, right and click on the screen, it's now locked onto where I want it to. So, I just wait for it to warm up and then I'll come back. So guys, it's warmed up now. Oh, whoops. So it now says 400. So I'm going to lock on somewhere. I'll lock on quite close. I'll lock on there. I'll come back and I'll put it in. Oh, I need a lever quickly. Got that. Now it fires up in the air, it's quite loud, and it'll come back, and boom. So yeah, you can use much stronger ones, and there are three different types of rocket... Earlier I said rocket launchers, uh, what are they called? Rocket platforms, sorry about that. So, this is the first type, then there's these, and then there's these. So this is the most simple one, so it only requires not that much energy, these can power it, but this and this, I don't know how you power them, because you need a lot more um, volts to power them, or I don't know if it's volts, whatever you measure them in. So they can fire much stronger weapons, so this is the best, they all have, each one has like better abilities, but I don't really know what they do, so I'll go on to number three I think it is. So guys, at number three is a hypersonic explosive. So these can really lag my computer. Uh, they are quite noisy, and basically, oh, uh, just watch. It might take a while for it to not lag, but it throws me in the air. You can probably hear that noise that they make. And loads of blocks just fall out of the sky. I think, yeah. There. It's just rendering. So, there. Just quite a lot of damage. Ruined my missile launching place. But yeah. So, they are quite cool. I'll fire one more. I'll put the mic nearer so you can hear the noise better. <laughs> So they are quite cool, and yeah, I'll move on to number two. So guys, at number two is an antimatter. If you watch my top ten ways to kill a creeper video, you saw at the end I used the nuke. This is sort of like that, but more powerful. So I'll put the mic nearer so you can hear. They do quite a lot of damage, so...
so no. they are quite noisy and they do a lot of damage. I think this is more powerful than the Tekkit Nuke though. Still rendering. You saw the pigs just die. I'll just set off another one because it's fun. So they are quite impressive and I like the sound effects they make. So yeah. <laughs> it lags and there so if you like this you're gonna want to see number one so guys this is a red matter explosive which is basically a black hole and it can only be cancelled by an antimatter explosive so this might lag and sometimes when it lags my voice isn't in sync with the video so sorry if that happens but I'll put the mic nearer so you can hear it and hopefully it won't lag too bad so guys I'll turn it down a bit as you can see there is just a black hole which sucks in the entire map and just keeps going so I'll try and get a better closer view oh lag so I might pause the video I don't know and then I might and then come back later but it is pretty impressive and then you can see it on the map. Uh, wrong one. You can just see the crater getting bigger. Oh. So this will keep going and going, but I might stop it. So the only way you can stop it is with an antimatter bomb. So you put it down and set it off and it gets sucked in and it's gone oh lag there and it's gone so that was only for about a minute so if you leave it too long it will blow up the whole world see that is huge compared to that that's two and then that's one um, red matter so thanks for watching guys I hope this video I hope you enjoy it and I'll just set off another one for fun check out my other videos please like, subscribe and post a comment and give me a comment on what um, videos I should make next so and I hope you enjoyed this video see you later guys